If I see it, I'll let you know. Lucifer's one world. I must warn you that as we venture further into the heart of darkness, you may be shocked by the atrocities unfolding below. Fifty users from commenting. This is just the sort of response I prepared for after dedicating myself to informing the masses about the real truth behind global events. Manhattan Project graduate, the Shadow
That burka was laundering money for the Bolivian drug cartels. So good riddance. Struggles to disentangle the Illuminist's web of fabrications and untruths. The shark refuses to subjugate herself to the insectoid's will, and thus is targeted as a threat. believe that 300,000 years ago, the insectoids created humans to mine the Earth's gold. But this is absurd. They're clearly more interested in our copper reserves. Clearly, the shark has been implanted with an RFID chip. The big fish resists the Babylonian Brotherhood and their conspiratorial
interest in an electrical transform. Maybe the shark is a metaphor. Best she doesn't dilly dally for two. That transformer must have been powering NASA's insidious Project Bluebeam. But how did the shark know?
unwanted attention. The patriotic Piscus must be swift to avoid capture. She should hurry, as trespassing on military property could result in a six-month prison sentence. Pursues the fleeing predator. I haven't seen a fish this wily since Babe Winkleman tried to catch that pike in northwestern Ontario. The Bull's Olfactory Center registers the sweet smell of freedom. The appetite of this shark is nearly insatiable. You can tell that this is old World War II technology, due to all the flickering. The bull shark is able to attain larger maximal sizes through selective feeding.
Now we see what the NWO's been hiding. Inside sources have ascertained its name, Moloch. This devious aquatic bioweapon is designed to disperse a mist of viral particulate, a potent combination of Ebola, anthrax, and Lassa fever. Within weeks, it will spread from Port Clovis to infect the entire world. Then, Big Pharma will reveal that they've developed a vaccine. The price? Every country must submit to the Insectoid Brotherhood. We must stop them before they can implement their demonic program. I have reason to believe I'm being spied on by the Pakistani government. The big fish must be a rat. Lest she unmask the New World Order's evil agenda. Shark demonstrates the importance of getting enough minerals in her diet. Are we sure we're at the right location? makes the holding of precious metals illegal.
the Dark Brotherhood withdraw to revitalize themselves with, one can only guess, the ritualistic drinking of human blood. sperm whale.
high-end fat burner is scientifically designed to stop cravings with 250 milligrams of pure sperm whale oil in every capsule. You've got whale, only from survival life. Sometimes even sharks just need to dirty ball. The apex predator comes up short. And so we begin. This is actually going quite well. These insectoids masquerading as men want to annihilate the world as we know. I can't impress enough the importance of core-driven swimming. She looks full of adrenaline. to come out on top. Did she repeat that performance in the 2024 Paris Games?
witnessing the rise of the next superstar athlete. The shark really needs to feel the water. I think that's her problem. The shark exhibits incredible maneuverability. Not fast enough, I'm afraid. Ready, set, go! I haven't witnessed such a fiery performance since Christina Eggerzaghi at the 92 Summer Games. <laughs> Swimming is one of the best forms of cardiovascular exercise available to sharks. Bravo Survivor, the irradiated bone sperm whale.
knows that the war isn't won with conventional weapons alone. That's why they sent the waves. With the swipe of her tail, the big fish sweeps back the enemy's dark and luministic maneuvers.